let's look at the film. In this video, we will take a look at Navel Gallimore. The guy is that guy. Hand placement, quick, get off the line. He using that, he using his size. And as a defensive lineman, you gotta have a quick first step. Hand got to be there too. Quick hands. That's what we're looking for. And watch how he uses his body, his leverage, his frame. Squeezes inside. And when you can turn the shoulders, that means a lot. Let's look back at this play. When we look at everything, watch how he get those shoulders and he flip those shoulders around. And he's still able to get small and knife through there. I like seeing that, Cowboy Nation. That ability to knife through there, still get to the runner. That is what we like to see, especially in any given situation. And he flexes on him. And on top of that, penetrating, getting upfield. That is what I'm seeing out of Nava Gallimore. He's able to do that, the Canadian monster, as we see right here. Watch how he's able to penetrate, get upfield, use that first step so quick. Watch that step. And this guy's still in his stance. If you can get the opposition playing on their heels, that's half of the battle. Because if you got them on their heels, then all you have to do is use a little leverage, a little weight, and you can get them off his marker. You get him off his market, chop that hand out. See how he chopped that hand down? So you got to have a great counter. Why do you get that counter there? Squeezes. He's already won. His body, he got the shoulders turned. When you get the opposition shoulders to turn, <laughs> you win it. <laughs> and he gets there, and he get the runner back down in the backfield. That is what we want to see. And watch Antoine Wood. He lined up at zero. Gallimore still within his gap assignment. Crashes down, pushes through the B and the A gap. I like seeing that, Cowboy Nation. I flat out do. And when you are a defensive lineman, it's all about how you can control that line, that LOS. Can you penetrate? Can you stop? And can you squeeze? He pushes everything back. That was a pivotal down. That was a fourth down play, by the way. So he's able to get him up off the field. On this particular play, although it's successful by Big Ben Roethlisberger, but watch the pressure. What this can tell me in the future that this kid, Gallimore, will be able to, if he can create constant pressure, and consider this right here, Cowboy Nation, the linebackers and the cornerbacks, they'll be able to step up a little bit quicker, and they will be able to jump on those routes a little bit better. So what I'm looking at when I think of Gallimore, I'm thinking of a dynamic guy. Yes, this is his rookie year. Yes, he had to go through some growing pains of learning uh, this style of defense, whether it be a one-gap or a two-gap or what have you. But I think that in time, if you give this kid a little bit more opportunities, we will see more out of him. I really appreciate you all for tuning in to this thing. Let me know how you all feel about Gallimore. I, I just feel like the way he plays up on the LOS and being able to rip havoc through there can go a long way. So post me your thoughts. Post me your concerns down below. Shout out to Gallimore. His ability to rip havoc. Have it, man. <laughs> the Canadian monster to get upfield, to be able to do all of those things goes a long way. That's been my time. I really thank you all for yours. And remember, you're listening to nothing but the best. Let's go. Let's go. Brutality. Fatality. <laughs>